North Carolina Central gets set to take on Winston-Salem State for the 43rd time in program history coming up this Saturday. The series tied at 21 apiece, so a win will put the Eagles up in that series. Chris Hooks joined by head coach Mose Rising as we get you set. I want to remind you that this preview is brought to you by G. Allen Incorporated. Coach, Winston-Salem State, that's all you really got to say. Absolutely. I mean, this rivalry has uh, been a long-standing rivalry for a long, long time, and and like you said earlier, it's the 43rd meeting between the two schools. I know they're excited. It's going to be senior day at their place. Uh, we're excited because we're trying to get a, a, a victory on the road. And so uh, we think that today's ball game will be an outstanding football game. Let's look at last year's game real quick. It was a contest where you exploded in the third quarter to take the lead, hung on for a 23-16 win. It was an all-out war as far as defense. It wasn't a ton of offense in that contest. Expecting the same? Well, you know, to be honest about it, uh, uh, pretty much the same. I mean, the weather was going to be was obviously going to be a factor. It's rain all week, and uh, I'm sure the the field is probably going to be uh, somewhat soggy. Um, and and any time the field gets a little soggy, a lot of times the ball game will probably turn into a defensive battle. You know, I don't want it to be that. I mean, I want us to, obviously I want the field to be dry, simply because of our team speed and what we do from an offensive standpoint and, and defensively as well. But. You know, any time you've had the weather we've had this past week, uh, it could very well, very easily be a defensive ball game. What are th some things some players can do to, to avoid slipping on, on a wet surface like like to, like it should be at Bowman Gray Stadium this weekend? Well, I mean, any time you know you're going you're gonna to play on a wet surface, I mean, the thing we talk about from a coaching standpoint is to make sure you narrow your base. You don't have as big a base. You don't open up as wide. And if you can do that, and then um, on top of that, when they come to the sideline, making sure that they get the cleats wiped off and that kind of thing. If we, if we do that, we should be okay. When you look at the, the Winston-Salem offense, they've, they've had some struggles this year in, in, in their games, really not a lot of 11 points a game is at this point in the season. Just talk about uh, what the Eagles are going to have to do to really keep Winston-Salem State from having that breakout performance. Well, I tell you what, number one, we've got to play great defense. Um, anytime we get an opportunity to, to – um, get them in second and third along, okay, we got to take advantage of that and make sure we get off the field. You're right. I mean, they're obviously due to have a, a good game from an offensive standpoint, but yet I say this. I mean, they've been in every ball game. I mean, nobody's actually blown them out. And of, 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 uh, recent, uh, of the recent ball games, they've actually played really well. And so we got to make sure from a defensive standpoint that we don't give up any big plays, no big runs, no big passes, okay, keep that offense, okay, uh, somewhat stagnant if we can do that, and then on top of that, take care of the ball offensively. All right, Coach. Well, thanks for your time. Good luck. Thanks, Chris. That was head coach Mose Rising, North Carolina Central, Winston-Salem State, 1 o'clock Saturday afternoon from Bowman Gray Stadium.